Not all surprises are created equal. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 RuPaul's Drag Race wig reveals slash fails. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're looking at the best and worst hairpiece unveilings, including any hair accessories in Drag Race history. We're basing our choices on a mix of timing, theatrics, and how well each removal fit into its lip sync. These are mostly bottom or top two lip sync battles, so a spoiler alert is in order. Number 10. Robbie Turner – Fail When Derek Barry hit the stage to face Robbie Turner, it seemed like we had a battle of two very different performance styles. Two queens stand before me. Ladies, this is your last chance to impress me and save yourself from elimination. But when Icona Pop's I Love It began to play, Robbie took a whole verse to start strutting. Turner eventually gained momentum and brought laughs and cheers throughout her eccentric performance. However, Turner's wig removal felt too sudden in the lip sync and stunted the excitement she'd built. I'm nailing it. Connect with my audience. Make them laugh. Make them want more. And then don't give it to them. All the head shaking she delivered afterwards felt pretty minimal without the hair to go with it. Robbie's monologue about not giving audiences what they want also suggested she enjoys toying with viewers. This bad attitude and Derek's all-out performance assured that Turner's elimination was well-deserved. Now I know I've got a heart because it's breaking. Now, sachet away. Number 9. Bibi Zahara Benet – Fail Despite the upbeat Deborah Cox song they had, Bibi Zahara Benet and Ben De La Creme kept themselves in place for much of their lip sync. While Ben Dilla moved around the stage more, Bibi gave intense face that had the judges smiling. As the song climaxed, however, Benet pulled off her headpiece to pretty lackluster reactions. Though the timing was on point, Bibi hurt her look quite severely. Aja also used the opportunity to denounce simple wig removals and implied that Benet ripped off Sasha Velour's iconic power move. You ain't no Sasha Velour, bitch. Keep your wig on. By damaging an already great lip sync, Bibi showed viewers that wig reveals could still feel gimmicky. <laughs> Number 8. Kenya Michaels – Fail As Latrice Royale kept the judges transfixed on her subdued performance, Kenya Michaels moved like there was no tomorrow. I used to feel so uninspired. All of Michaels' moves were impressive, as she danced literal circles around Latrice at one point. However, Royale proved a much stronger and emotional lip sync to a natural woman, and won the judges over. You're the key to my peace of with such a low energy in the room, Kenya's energetic choreography looked more like a cry for attention. Michael's wig pull lacked any buildup either, which caused Santino to instantly shake his head in disappointment. With dancing that didn't match the song she was given, Kenya shattered any chance she had at winning when she took off her hair. You made me feel, you made me feel like a natural woman. Number 7. Shangela and Venus Delight Fail. For Shangela's lip sync against Venus Delight, the pair began with the kind of wacky moves you'd expect from such loud personalities. Just as their battle got interesting, Venus pushed Shangela. Then Delight whipped off her own wig and threw it violently at the queens watching from the back. Venus gets physical, but you know what? Even when pushed, you can't stop me. Shangela in turn twirled her hair up high and kicked off her shoe towards the ceiling. By the time Venus used Shangela's skirt as a weapon, RuPaul's frown turned into a scowl. After the unprofessional conduct from Delight and Shangela, their wig pulls came off as disrespectful to the competition as a whole. Number 6. Milan – Fail Milan always puts passion into her performances, and it was on full display in her showdown with Jiggly Caliente. My mama told me when I was young, we're all on superstars. So hold your head up, girl, and you'll go far. Jiggly's spontaneity dominated the dance, however, next to Milan's repetitive power moves. Then Milan simply copied her dancing. While Milan tore her afro off, too, this could have been seen as getting caught up in the moment. 
born this way was interpreted too literally, though, when Milan went topless as well. As the routine became more performance art than drag, Fifi condemned Milan for intentionally presenting as male. Milan, girl, that's clearly a dude. All of Milan's desperate wardrobe changes weren't only bad choices, but they also betrayed the essence of drag itself. We're born this way. Number 5. Peppermint Win Before the finale of Season 9, Peppermint shocked the judges when she revealed a pixie cut under her wig. Her battle with Trinity Taylor was much more evenly matched, though, and the two traded power moves throughout the entire lip sync. Trinity twisted off her skirt and crawled around the stage, which easily got the crowd screaming. Right at the climax of the song, though, Peppermint spun out of her skirt and wig in one fluid motion. The biggest surprise was the white pixie hairdo hidden underneath, and the long, flowing skirt that emerged from her dress after. Thanks to the extra finesse and twists in her lip sync, Peppermint's hair was worth the standing ovation it received. Number 4. Bibi Zahara Benet and Angina Win both Bibi Zahara Benet and Angina were on fire in their lip sync as they strutted and shook their bodies across the runway. Angina used all the energy of the chorus and threw her hairpiece down with a fierce attitude. After whipping her own mane around, Bibi took her wig off and hit the floor like an animal. Benet twitched violently and she put her whole body into her final moves. Both contestants' androgynous haircuts avoided the often anticlimactic feeling of wig reveals, and their timing was also on point. All the triumphant emotion from these queens saw their risky moves as appropriate and striking. Number 3. Latrice Royale and Moni Cart win. The moment you have all been waiting for! Guess who's back, back, back again? No, not Alyssa Edwards, but Latrice motherfucking Royale. In a not so surprising twist, the eliminated queens re entered the competition for a chance to lip sync for their life. In a decision that's not personal, but definitely personal, according to Royale, she had to prove her worth to come back to the competition against Brown Cow herself. The decision pretty much made itself. It is definitely not personal. We didn't expect any less from these two fierce queens, but two wig reveals? We weren't ready, America. Latrice timed her wig snatch perfectly to the beat drop to reveal a brunette wig fit for some hair whips and high kicks. Uh -oh. Now sissy that wow. Brown Cow revealed her shortly after, showing off a fiery orange wig that complemented the energy of her performance. The judges were so impressed with this lip sync that both ladies got to stay in the competition. Monique Hart, you are and will always be an all-star. Oh, and one more thing. Shantae, you stay. Number 2. Roxy Andrews win while dancing is usually the highlight of the bottom two, Willow Smith's Whip My Hair moved the choreography to the head. Alyssa Edwards went into overdrive and used her dance background to command attention from the judges. Within seconds of hitting the runway, Roxy had already reached for her wig. But Rue was awestruck when Andrews unfurled a second wig under her hair, which also left Michelle Visage screaming. With just one wig on, Roxy spun her head so much it made us dizzy. <laughs> Andrew's inventive move helped keep her on Drag Race and inspired countless copycats on following seasons. It's gonna be a photo finish tonight. <laughs> Before we get to our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Oh crap, my wig was hanging on by one freaking bobby pin. I'm not keeping that bitch on my head. Might as well go, it's in my way. Number 1. Sasha Velour Win 
for one of the final showdowns of Season 9, Sasha Velour started off by plucking rose petals to the beat. While Shea Coulee had smooth dance moves, Sasha launched more petals out of her gloves on screams and choruses, Just as Velour's energy picked up with the song, she pulled off her hair and rained even more petals down. The extra props were a beautiful surprise and instantly turned the crowd in Sasha's favor. The reveal also played off as more of a look swap thanks to Velour's iconic bald head. As much as the wig reveal had been overdone in Drag Race, Sasha reinvented it into something emotional. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.